The environmental briefing app can be used by environmental agencies and departments of transportation to provide map-based briefings and reports regarding development projects and potential impacts to the environment. This application can be used on its own or in combination with other ArcGIS for state government environmental applications and is a configuration of the ArcGIS Story Map Journal that uses your data, enabling you to communicate with internal and external stakeholders regarding the projects and environmental factors evaluated. The briefing presents contextual information alongside responsive maps to provide an interactive experience for the user. In this scenario, we are evaluating two possible routes for a commuter rail line connecting Miami with West Palm Beach. Using bookmarks in the panel, we can zoom the map to highlight specific locations of interest, and the user can further inspect the map to get more information about the proposed station locations and study area. We can also present additional graphics to support communicating the overall project goals and scenarios. A population density map helps to visualize the population that will be supported with the proposed rail line. Additionally, the data used to analyze the environmental impacts is included in the briefing for further inspection along with the analysis results. In a graphic, we can see a comparison summary of the potential impacts between the proposed and alternate study locations. We can even include links to the detailed analysis reports. The Environmental Impact Briefing app allows us to reference other applications. If desired, we can include a link to an application that allows citizens to provide comments to the proposed projects. The Environmental Impact Briefing application can be deployed by environmental agencies, departments of transportation, and commercial organizations, and used by citizens and stakeholders on desktop computers, smartphones, and tablet devices. To learn more about Environmental Impact Briefing and configure it for your organization, please visit the Solutions site. Thanks for watching.